You are listening to the Q Your Business Success Podcast, Episode 8. Do you ever feel like you are treading water in your business? You're busy with clients and you're both excited and scared about the future because you've noticed that things are starting to fall through the cracks. Maybe you've had some staff turnover and you've, you're scrambling. Maybe you don't have time to process new leads or your lack of systems is showing up in missed deadlines or late client deliverables. In this episode, I'm going to share a really powerful self-coaching tool that you can use to stop treading water in your business and ride the wave instead. So let's get started. Are you ready to cue your business success? Entrepreneurs and business owners tune into this podcast for top marketing, sales, and leadership strategies to grow and scale your business. Hosted by Michaela Quilici, award-winning international business growth coach and marketing consultant. Since 2010, Michaela has helped hundreds of business owners navigate their business growth on purpose. She has been featured in Canadian Living Magazine, USA Weekly, and Business Innovators. Michaela is also a contributing author in the best-selling book, Conscious Business, and a member of the Forbes Coaches Council. If you want to learn some tactics you can put to work in your business today to get noticed, get clients, and get profitable, listen to this episode. And if you want to move even faster, connect with Michaela directly at MichaelaQuilici.com. Here's Michaela. I recently re-engaged with a client who I had previously worked with. He's the CEO of a fast-growing accounting and bookkeeping practice. The first time around, we worked on refining his marketing message so that all of his marketing collateral and sales communication was super aligned with what his firm represents. As a result of our work together, when he presents to prospects, he's able to better engage more of the right clients, service them more fully, and work with them over the long term. He has had considerable revenue growth as a result. So when he hit another roadblock in his business, he reached out to me for more help. This time around, when I asked him about what was going on in his business, this is what he told me. He said, Michaela, I feel like I'm treading water. My business is growing and I'm both excited about the future and scared because things are starting to fall through the cracks due to my ineffective processes and lack of proper systems to really support this stage of the business. I have no clear growth plan or clear vision for the future. I know I need to make some changes, but I don't know how. I'm tired of being on the fence with this and I know I need to jump, but I don't have a roadmap. I need your help. So I thought this would make a good topic for today's episode because I know a lot of business owners in growth mode face the same issue and maybe you can relate. Some business owners are so deep in the weeds of running their business that before they know it, they've lost perspective on the long-term vision and they feel like they're constantly working in reactive mode or they feel like they're behind the eight ball all the time. To be honest, it's exhausting. Did you know that in response to acute stress, the body's sympathetic nervous system is activated due to the sudden release of hormones? The sympathetic nervous system stimulates the adrenal glands, triggering the release of adrenaline and noradrenaline, resulting in an increase in heart rate, blood pressure, and breathing rate. After the threat is gone, it takes between 20 to 60 minutes for the body to return to its pre-arousal levels. So if emotionally your reptilian brain is in fight, flight, or freeze mode, a lot of the time, it makes it nearly impossible to be calm and resourceful. The states you need to be in so that you can create a vision and a plan for the future. So this leads me back to you, the business owner. When I work with my private coaching clients, I'm like their business navigator and my tools are a compass and a roadmap. And one of the foundational components for building a successful roadmap is to develop a solid outcome frame. An outcome frame is a wonderful self-coaching framework that you can use for just about anything when you want to create change. Communicating without an outcome, 
That's like taking a trip without a destination. If you don't know where you're going, how will you know how to get there? How will you know if you got there? Right? So the outcome frame is a powerful goal setting technique. There's several uh, components to creating a good outcome frame, but every good outcome frame starts with one basic premise, which is asking powerful questions. And as I like to say, the quality of your answer is dependent on the quality of your question. So if you're not getting the answer that you want, the clarity that you need, ask a better question. When you want to be somewhere other than where you are, I invite you to take out a piece of paper and a pen or some other writing instrument or recording device and imagine for a moment that you create your own reality and really enter into that realm of possibilities. Success is inevitable and leaders understand that failure leads to learning and ultimate success. So from that space, I invite you to ask yourself the four key questions of the outcome frame. Number one, what do I want? Number two, how might I get it? Number three, how might I commit to that? And number four, how will I know if I've gotten it? The secret to moving forward with focus and wild abandon is to have clarity of purpose, a strong felt sense for why you're doing it, the resolve to stop tolerating what you have and the hunger to go for what you really, really want, no matter what. Success is inevitable, provided you keep taking action, commit to showing up, refine your approach and work on your inner game as well as your outer game and keep at it long enough. If you find yourself spinning your wheels or treading water in your business and you're getting tired of that, maybe it's time to ask yourself those four key questions from the outcome frame. Are you ready to step into the driver's seat of your business? Drop by our online community at cueyourbusinesssuccess.com and tell us what is the one thing you're going to do to get clarity on your destination. We'd love to show you some love and to support you on your journey and help light up the path for a successful outcome. This is Michaela Quilici, your host. Thanks so much for listening today. Let me ask you this. Have you ever felt the remarkable power and energy of a coach when they're laser focused on you and your business? If you're ready to get expert support, I'd love to offer you a complimentary business clarity session with me. During our call, you will create a crystal clear vision for ultimate business success, get focused on the next most powerful step toward your goals, uncover the hidden challenges that could be sabotaging your sales and marketing efforts, and you will leave the session renewed, re-energized, and inspired to finally grow your business faster and easier than ever before. I have very limited spots available, so if you want to take advantage of this offer, I invite you to apply today by going to meetwithmikaela.com.